Hi, I'm Dan Cruz, president of Century 21 Affiliated, joined here today with CEO and founder Bill Kessler, and welcome back to a uh, market update with Dan and Bill. Uh, last time we were in front of you on the camera, we were talking a little bit about the global conference out in Las Vegas and getting ready to take stage as the number one Century 21 in the world. It was an outstanding event. We had a lot of fun. We had over 125 agents throughout the Century 21 affiliated system there to join us on stage and cheer us along. Take a look at this video and see all the fun we had and education we got out in Las Vegas. The number one company in the U.S. and the world by units. Bill Kessler and Dan Cruz with Century 21 Affiliated. Uh, I just wanted to say one uh, thank you to this group right here. It's this group that made all this possible. They believed in a vision that we put together about three years ago, Bill, myself, Tom and Adam and our ownership team, and they executed. And this would not be possible without this awesome group of people. So thanks to all of you. Congratulations again to Century 21 Affiliated. I hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, as you can tell, we had a great time. If you didn't get out with us this year, uh, hopefully you can join us next year uh, in 2015. Bill, let's talk now a little bit about the market and what we've seen. Tell me a little bit about your thoughts on how quarter one was of 2014. Well, first, that was the G version of the video. <laughs> and we still had a great time, didn't we? Yes, we did. I mean, we just really rocked Vegas. It was so cool to be number one and for all our agents to be excited about it for what they accomplished for all of us. First quarter. So the first quarter of 2014 did exactly what we predicted. Um, we're, I don't know if lucky or unlucky, but did exactly what we predicted, which is because of the horrible weather, because of the paucity of inventory, and because of certain other uncertainties, it was a slow first quarter compared to 2013, even 2012. But we expected that because the buyer demand was there. So the inquiries over the internet were at an all-time record high, especially compared to a year ago. So we knew that, that it was going to burst, and it did burst. It burst in the, when we had the little bit of a warm weather in March, and it burst again when we had warm weather in April. And we have a ton of uh, accepted offers waiting for closing in April and to May. And now, every day, more and more properties get above water, i.e., the owners think that they can afford to sell because the home is worth was worth seven years ago, finally. And more things are coming on the market. And that's been our biggest problem and the biggest problem of the industry for the last 14 months, which is getting quality inventory to the marketplace. Now that it's happening, then the market is happening. I, I couldn't agree more. I think the biggest challenge we faced outside of the weather that we had was good listing inventory. And now we've already seen it throughout the month of April. Inventory is starting to come back a little bit, but we do got to continue to increase our listing inventory. If we do that, we're going to win the sign battle and ultimately bring in more buyers. And I think that's going to mean we're going to have a really strong spring and summer season. In my opinion, we're going to have a kind of a condensed selling season this year. Because January, February, March, we've had that bad weather and it was slower. I think April, we've already started to see it. But really, May and June, I think we can see a, a lot of activity. And I think if our agents are hungry and they're out there willing to work, they're going to have a very, very strong couple months ahead. Yeah, summer vacations have been eliminated. Yes. Uh, we're, we're going to be working. <laughs> And 
it's really key to get back to your clients, the sellers, your clients, the buyers every day because the market does change every day as it improves and as appreciation impacts. Yep. Well, we want to keep these short and impactful, so we appreciate all of you spending time with us today. Uh, welcome to another Market Minute. We'll be back in May to give you more updates on what's going on with an affiliated and within the industry in general. Remember, go out there, build your listing inventory, and uh, get ready for a strong selling spring and summer season. Thank you. Thank you.